In Local 10's exclusive series, Cuba Coast to Coast, Local 10 News reporter Hatzel Vela met a priest in the province of Camagüe who in the end had a connection to the father of one of our producers. And today, after more than 60 years, the two old friends were able to meet. Here's Hatzel with this touching story. <laughs> a chuckle when he spots an old friend. <laughs> The priest jokes, he looks younger. Both were only 16 the last time they saw each other. Two stories that begin in Cuba. We first meet Father Jose Grau last summer during our coast-to-coast -coast journey in Cuba. He is the priest at La Iglesia de la Soledad, a church in Camagüey. After interviewing him, we realize he once lived in Palma Soriano, the same town as the father of our producer, Michelle Lacamoire. Father Grau automatically knew the last name. He knew Freddie Lacamoire. In, un mundo tan, tan complejo que in such a complex world, how is it possible, he says, that you would visit my church when the city has so many? Too much coincidence? Surely the hand of God, he says. Oh. <laughs> Freddie says his friend hasn't changed much. Well, except for the hair, or lack thereof. Before his departure, we asked Grau about the changes in Cuba. He says access to the internet is one of the most significant because it will help empower the Cuban people. Mientras mayor sea el intercambio y mayor la cercanía, hay más. When there's more exchange of ideas, more closeness, he says, the better it will be for all. But today, it was about Freddie and Jose. A reunion of two old pals, a friendship that started 60 years ago. In Miami, Hatzel Vela, Local 10 News. Wow, 60 years ago, separated by the ocean, no doubt, and clearly the memories are still intact. And as the father said, now with the internet, so many of those connections are beginning yeah. to happen again. Yeah, and they looked a little different. And, you know, that, that, that laugh was so real <laughs> when he first saw it. They can recognize it. each other, though. Yeah. They, they look at each other and see a 16-year-old kid, right? Isn't Absolutely. That fun?